all these twists and turns have turned into a whole new thing. It's the filmmaking episode, Taboo American Style Part 3. <laughs> Invitation to Love will continue. All right, updates. We got a lot of updates. Mom is still pilled out. It's okay, this one's PG. Dad has got his daughter into the entertainment business. Raven is now an actor. Tom's home from college. He brings his new girlfriend. There's not a Chenansky in sight, nor our director, Henri Pichard, is no therapist in this one. This is a great episode. However, no therapist and no Chenanskys, that is like, I don't even know. They're going to have to bring their A game. Okay, we got a lot of new cast members. Joey Silvera plays the director. His wife, Deidre Weiss, is played by Sarah Bernard. And one other. Oh, Tom has a girlfriend home from college. All three of the new members step up, which is amazing. And his girlfriend is Marilyn Wilkerson, played by Carol Cross. Okay, my favorite thing of this episode, the award goes to. We're going to call it Double Stare, Neck Brace, Coffee Sip Steel. Let's show it in a wonder. Morning, Marilyn. Morning, Mr. Sutherland. Morning, Tom. Morning. How's Mother? Mother's still sleeping. Mm. It's a good one. Let's watch it. I'm Jason from Barefoot. This is Squeaky Clean Adult Films, and I'll be at the end talking as well. Enjoy. And now, part three. Tom's coming to visit. Nina, we're gonna have to talk about this. Who's bringing his new girlfriend? Marilyn is Tom's new girlfriend. He was better suited to her than Lisa. David Weiss is a very important business associate of mine. I've got to raise a lot of money for him. He can make millions of dollars for us. Millions? Yes. What does he do? He's a movie producer. What films has he made? Mrs. Sutherland? Yes, Ginger. Ginger, you know that Tom's coming home today? Mrs. Sutherland? Yes, Ginger. I'm going to stick right behind you. Thanks, Ginger. Did I tell you that Tom is coming home today? I missed you. God, I missed you. <laughs> I really missed you. Okay, Mom. All right. Um, Mom, I want you to meet Marilyn Wilkerson. Hi, Mrs. Sutherland. Tom's told me so much about you. And I'm so very glad to meet you, and I hope that you'll stay with me for a long, long time. Well, Mom, I was planning to stay the week, but uh, Marilyn has to be getting back mm -hmm. to prepare her final project. Um, only a week? No, 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 no. You, you, you both got to stay with me for much. Much longer. Well, is everything okay? You, you seem a little frazzled. Well, your your father. I... No, actually, everything everything's fine. I'm fine, and Harding's fine, and Nina's. Um, why don't you come on in, and I'll make you some milk and cookies. <laughs> Thanks, Mama. We drink scotch now. That's right, Mrs. Sutherland. My English lit teacher thinks I may have a career as a novelist. Uh, he's going to recommend that I attend a writer seminar in Iowa this summer. Well, <clears throat> Thomas, you know, I'm certainly very proud of you doing so well in school. But if you should decide to change over to finance, I would stand right behind you. You know that. Nina, how about you? Have you given any thought to what you plan on studying? I know what I want to study. 
but I don't think they teach it in school. You must be very proud of your daughter, Mrs. Sutherland. My head sure wasn't put together like that when I was her age. No. Yes. Mother, you all right? Oh, yes, dear. I, I'm, I'm just fine. Ah, oh, what a delicious meal. What's for dessert? Oh, Tom, we could watch Dynasty. Tom, I was thinking, maybe you and I could have a talk after dinner? That would be nice, Tom. Sure. I always believe in a close family. Is everyone enjoying the meal? What do you think of Marilyn? What do you think of her? Nina, how, how are things really? Dad seems okay, but Mom's really out of it. I wouldn't worry about her. Yeah, you're probably right. Just menopause or whatever old women go through. Still sleeping. Mm. I've got to call David Weiss. Oh, right, the producer. Yeah, roll camera, roll camera, roll Action. You've lied to Papa. You've lied to get ahead. I didn't lie. Uh, cut, cut, cut. Wait a minute, wait, wait. Um, look. Kids, uh, what do you think we're shooting here, anyways? Little Abner or something? This is a very important scene in this movie, okay? David Weiss Productions. Hello, this is Harding Sutherland. Who? Harding Sutherland. I'd like to speak to David Weiss, please. What company are you with? He knows me already. Hold, please. Yes, thank you. It's, it's the center of the script, which means it's the turning point, okay? So this time from you, I'd like a little more Mr. sensitivity. Weiss, you have a telephone call. Later. And from you, I need David, some emotion, okay? Because I David, just... will you come out here? What? I've been waiting for you for 25 minutes. If we don't leave now, we're going to hit rush hour traffic. This is my wife, okay? Look, go take a seat, okay? Now, who calls? Harding Sutherland. Harding Sutherland. Harding Sutherland. The Sutherlands, David, don't you remember? Harding Sutherland. Oh, my God. Everybody <clears throat> places? Shut up. If we don't go see Harding Sutherland, we don't shoot this movie. Tell uh, Mrs. Sutherland that we, we left 20 minutes ago. We're on our way, okay? Wrap it up, folks. Be back first thing Monday morning. Good guess. I'm sorry. Uh, uh, David, uh, would you mind if I rewrote my lines over the weekend? They're just not me. You're right. You're, you're right. You know, those lines are just not you. Thanks for the idea. Did you bring some clothes? Yeah. All right, save the lights. Bye, Mrs. Sutherland. It was really nice to have met you. I had a great time. Good. Bye, Mr. Sutherland. Marilyn, goodbye. Nice Maria, Marilyn will be late. Dad, Marilyn and I are going into town for dinner, and I'm driving through the bus. That's yeah, fine, Tom. It's fine. You have a good time. <sighs> David, would you just relax? Relax. Baby, I have three days to raise a million dollars. Unless the movie is off. You're a mess. Clean yourself up. Come on. You're a mess? Come on. You're a mess. Fix your tie. All right. Yeah, I got you. I got you. I got you. What are you doing renting this? Limousines. How can we afford this? Relax. Don't worry about the limousines. It's just fine. Yeah. It's just fine. What kind of people are these Sutherlands, anyway? Blue-blooded. Uh, they're about six generations. They live in a mansion. You mean I'm going to have to sit around and talk about pastry recipes all weekend? Yeah. How do I look? You look fine. You look this? Good. Great. God, what a way to spend the holidays. Just relax. Nina! Emily! They're here! Hello, hello, hello. Congratulations. 
Hardy. Hello, Hardy. Hello, Jay. Oh, yeah. How are you? How are you? You look great. You look great. Hardy, my wife, Deirdre. Deidre is very nice to meet you. Very nice. Deidre, this is my wife, Emily. Emily, this is Deidre and David Weiss, my and dear child. Hello, Charles. David. And David and Deidre, this is my daughter, Nina. Hello, Hello Nina. Nina. Hello. Well, why don't we run into the other room? Excuse me there. Good to see you. Good to see you. I told you they'd be bored. Come on, it's really nice having a formal affair in the house against once more, isn't it, Harding? Yes, dear, I think it's marvelous. I'm really sorry that our son couldn't be with us here tonight. I'm shattered. Why don't you have some more wine, darling? <coughs> yes, but, but Tom is a writer, and who knows, maybe someday he, he could write something for Mr. Weiss. Emily, I don't think the Weisses want to talk about Tom. <coughs> so, David. Harding. Nina, Nina, tell me something. You like movies? Mm -hmm. You ever thought about being in movies? Like mm -hmm. every girl, I guess it has crossed my mind. Oh, has it now? Oh, good. Ginger makes the best salads. Should we start down here? Really glad you people could come. Aren't you, Emily? Yes, yes. <clears throat> it's going to be a lovely night. Emily used to do all the cooking here. Uh, used to? Well, before we hired Ginger. Oh, Ginger, yes. Mm -hmm. Nina's learning to cook. Nina's a cook? Mm -hmm. Aren't you, Nina? Yes, Father. Never again. Never again, David. Okay. Yeah. Fantastic. This is our new Miss Samantha right here, huh? Thanks, David. Look, you got a lot of lines to learn. We're shooting today. Can you handle it? I can try. Fantastic. Okay, look, go into dressing room C and see Donna, okay? She put a little makeup on you and uh, run lines, okay? Okay. Fantastic. <sighs> hey, I think we got a pretty good agreement here, huh? We're both reasonable men, and uh, I can't anticipate any problems. I don't see why there should be any problems at all. She knocked her dead. Yeah, well, yeah, you could say that, yeah. Um, what about the little thing with the bank? Oh, the money. The money. I took care of the money yesterday. Great. Hi, everybody. Sorry I'm late. Um, hey, what do you want me? Uh, dressing room C? Uh... Don't worry, I'll only be second. Laura? Holy <laughs> shit. What's she doing in my dressing room? In my dress? Reading my script? Well, look, come here, Laura. Look, look, this is a little problem, that's all. Sit here, I'm going to tell you, I'm going to tell you. Mom, you awake? Mom? Mom? You awake? Tom? Tom, is that you? Mom, you okay? You okay, Mom? I don't know. I think so. From the top, action. You got a lot of nerve, girl. You have been goring and teasing and driving all the boys in town crazy. Isn't that my right? Cut. Fantastic. Fantastic. Nina, that's the first time I've ever seen that scene played as written. Both were fantastic. That was wonderful. That was wonderful. So what's next? Uh, for you, you're a wrap for the day, but I want you your first thing in the morning. <laughs> we can go? Yeah. David, can I talk to you for a minute? Yeah. <sighs> what is it? Well, David, I'd like to ask you a favor. Sure. It's about my father. He's really disrupting my concentration. He's like, he's being a toad. I'd like to have him off the set. Okay, yeah, no problem. Thanks, David. It'll be our secret. Great. I hope his check clears. I guess Dad and Nina are really caught up in this movie business, huh? I ran a bath for you. What? 
Yeah, I ran a really nice hot bath for you. <laughs> Mom, I'm 19 years old. <laughs> Nineteen. Uh, the water is still running. Mom, I'm in college now. Please. funny, huh? Um, listen, I really think we ought to try to choose your roles more carefully in the future. Daddy, right? whose career is it? Yours or mine? My queen. Sweetheart, my movie star, sweetheart. The world's our oyster. Daddy, I would really like to have my wine alone. like it? What do you think? No Chenanskis? No therapist? Three new characters? A whole new plot? We're making movies. How did you like how that girl got replaced? She showed up to work. No one told her she didn't have a job. Now part three has a description instead of a title. And then when I was looking at all of them, I'll take a screenshot, I realized, okay, it's a flat out description instead of a title. It's just a miniseries part three. That's the subtitle. But then I looked at part one, two, and four. Granted, they're not as obviously of a description, but they are a description. Part one is just the ruthless beginning. Part two is the story continues. And part four is the exciting conclusion. Those are pretty much descriptions as well, with a little more oomph put into them. But part three is just like, hey, this is a mini series and it's part three. Recognize. Can anyone find me? Do you know that Raven wrote and directed one movie? It's called Something 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 The Fisherman's Wife. The Something Something was like the series it's from. A Fisherman's Wife. I found two versions of it on two websites and they're both not in English. Not subtitled. Just dubbed. Can, if anyone can find me that, I will provide you with a clean version of it. Just like Victoria Paris. Victoria Paris got behind the camera and did one only one too, just like Raven. And we did that. So I think we should do that little a series of one-offs. Thank you for watching. Yakety schmackety, blah, blah, blah. Shamalama, ding dong. Did I say yakety schmackety? I'll see you tomorrow. Or wait, the invitation to love uh, title card. Why don't you take us out of here? Oh, but first I loved the end that I made to this. You know, you know our little ch turning the channel off where it's got that boom, that's replaced with a slap. But there's a slip and a slap and a slip and a slap and the slip is the slap is not even uh, in the movie you just watched. It's an outtake. We don't usually do that.
I'll see you guys soon. Tune in tomorrow for Invitation to Love. Mm. Mm. Mm.